Hello and welcome back to Space Engineers. In today's video, we're looking at another mod that should really be part of the base game because of how useful it is. This mod is called the Small Connector Converter, which is well not this stuff that you can see behind me so I'm not too sure why I panned away from my character, but it does exactly what it says on the tin. You can take a small block connector and put it up to the large one which you can see on the left hand side and you can move stuff around all within limitations of what each block can handle. So with the pan over to this little ship, which I believe I have done a showcase on beforehand, but there will be a link to it in the description below if you are interested in it. This is the small block connector, and if we were to dock this up to the large one, we're still limited by what the small connector and small conveyors can handle, so we can move raw resources through, but actual large components will not be able to transfer, because they simply can't, so that's the way the game has been set up. So for a small demonstration, what I'm going to do is now just grab hold my character and get into the little hopper ship. So we're into this, and we're going to just line myself up all nicely. But yes, once you've added this in through the mod menu, that's all you need to do with this mod. There is no new blocks in this mod menu, there is no scripts or anything you need to set up yourself to make this work. It's just simply plug it in play and away you go. So we're going to move all the way up to this and we're going to connect up the large one to the large one just as a small starting demonstration. So using this camera that I placed below here so I can properly line this up, I'm just going to drop it down and connect up and press P. If we were to come into here and look at this connector, this is the connector attached onto the moon. Well, I've got some large steel tubes, some metal grids, medical components, iron ingots, and iron ore. And because it's a large to large, we can move all of that easily across into the ship. Now, if we were to put that all the way back onto the moon connector, disconnect that, pull it away if I can remember the controls, switch over to this camera. So now it's time for me to actually dock this one up by reversing it all the way up. And now we're going to drop this down. So going like that, we automatically slap in place like a proper connector. I can press P, come into here, and now you move the resources across, but we cannot move the large components, because that's going to be the limitations of the base game. It was a green free camera all the way over, so we can see what's going on. And there we are, that is simply how it connects up. So there's the small one, there's the large one, and that's simply what it looks like. I can actually fully really understand why Keen hasn't done this in the base game already, because it does look kind of dodgy with the way it works. There's a massive gap there, and it doesn't really look like it's been properly connected up. But there we are, that's basically all this mod does. And I thought some people might actually really enjoy this. I know I will, especially when playing through, because it means I don't have to fit on a large connector onto a ship. I can simply have this small one and be ready to go connect to any old base, any old station, without needing to worry about trying to fit on that big bulky one sitting next to it that does take up quite a lot of room. As for that, that is it for this video. There's nothing else to talk about with this mod. It's very self-explanatory what it does. It's just something that is very useful at the end of the day. So there'll be a link to this mod in the description below, along with a link to the ship that I'm currently using. And then I suppose I'll also put a link to the skybox I'm also using. It's very nice, very blue. It's got some nice dark patches. It's got nice light patches and light blue and white. It does look very nice, especially from the moon surface. Anyway, thank you all for watching. And I'll be back with another video sometime soon. Bye bye.